Roswell Flight Test Crew here at the Interdrone Expo 2017 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm here with our good friend Randall Warnus from FLIR. How are you doing, Randall? Doing well. How are you? I'm very good. Now, you guys here at the show have got a brand new piece of hardware. Tell us about That's it. true. Today we're happy to announce our newest member of the SUAS line, the FLIR Duo Pro R. Now, what does this do for us? Everybody remembers the little Duo, which is about the size and shape of a GoPro, but this looks quite a bit bigger. Absolutely. This is going to have a 640 or 336 thermal imaging option coupled with a 12 megapixel 4K RGB camera. So that's basically the performance people will be getting out of the View Pro, but with the visible light added. Exactly, but we've added some other features onto this camera as well. Such as? Such as we have an onboard IMU and GPS, along with a barometer, a humidity sensor, just to make sure that the image quality from the camera is better, and they can be used in mapping and ortho mosaic missions. So this is the Duo Pro R, which means radiometric, so remind everybody what that means. Yeah, so we decided to only have radiometric versions of this camera. First of all, to emphasize the quality and the premium status of this camera, but also it gives you the ability to see the temperature of every pixel within the image rather than just the center point temperature. So you're looking at actual temperature rather than relative temperature. Fantastic. Now I also see you've got two memory cards on board and two different outputs. What's going on there? Definitely true. So the two uh, memory cards are so you can record both thermal and visible camera simultaneously. And the two outputs give you flexibility for integration. You have either an HDMI output for digital or you have a USB output for the analog video. Now speaking of integration, the View Pro wasn't super easy to get plugged into an SUAS. How are you guys doing on that side of things? So we've significantly stepped up the ease of integration with the Duo, and this is significantly easier to integrate than even that. And you retain Mavlink compatibility? So it does have Mavlink uh, for the protocol, as well as a 10-pin uh, PWM, so that you can integrate it with a gimbalized system, and so that it fully communicates within the ecosystem of your airframe. And then finally, I've already got the FLIR SUS app installed on my smartphone, so can I still use Bluetooth to steer this thing around? Absolutely, so you would have Bluetooth connectivity to change settings within the app. Fantastic. So from the Interdrone Expo in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew, signing off. Thanks, Randall.